Hey, what's up? Jigs are here. If you're looking to free up space in your iCloud Drive on your iPhone, here are some effective steps you can take. In this video, I'll show you how to do this. Let's go. iCloud is Apple's cloud service that keeps your data in sync across your devices. It stores various data types like photos, videos, and backups. While it offers 5 gigabytes for free, this can fill up quickly due to default settings. If you don't want to buy more storage, you can free up space in iCloud to continue using it. When your iCloud space is about to fill up, you'll be constantly reminded via pop-up saying not enough storage, iCloud storage full, or upgrade storage. You can find out how much free space you have on iCloud by going to Settings, Apple ID, then iCloud. To know what is taking up your iCloud space, tap Manage Account Storage. When your iCloud storage gets full, things can start to go wrong. You might not be able to back up your device, new photos, and videos won't save to iCloud Photos, and your files won't sync between devices. Also, you won't be able to send or receive emails with your iCloud email address. You can free up storage in iCloud by deleting content that you're not using. But before deleting anything, you might want to make copies of the information that you store in iCloud. To copy your files from iCloud to your device, use these steps. Open the Files app and choose Browse to show locations, then select iCloud Drive. Consider sorting or filtering your files by size. This way you can easily identify the largest files and decide whether to move or delete them first. By focusing on the biggest files, you can quickly reclaim a significant amount of storage space in your iCloud. To select, click again the More button. Tap Select, then choose the files and folders you want to copy. Choose how you want to send a copy of the file. Tap the Share button. Then tap Copy Items. Go to On My Device or another cloud service in Locations. Touch and hold a folder in the new location, then Paste. After saving your files locally, consider transferring the files to OneDrive or Google Drive, as it can free up valuable storage on your iPhone and also provide secure cloud storage. Download first and install the OneDrive or Google Drive app. Open the Files app on your iPhone. Select the files you want to transfer. Tap the Share icon and choose either Save to OneDrive or to Google Drive. Afterward, check out the Recommended for You section in your iCloud settings. This feature can help you find photos, large files, or backups that you may not need anymore and can safely delete. To access it, simply go to Settings, Apple ID, iCloud then Recommended for You. Here you'll see the Review Backups, Review Photos and Videos, and Review Large Files to get space back, but if you don't see any of these options, you can still manually delete content from iCloud. Now, to delete unnecessary files and folders from the iCloud Drive, open the Files app. Tap Browse to locate iCloud Drive, then choose the files or folders you want to delete. Click the Select All option if you want to delete everything or just select the files manually. Then tap the Delete icon or Trash Can. Remember that deleting files from iCloud Drive will remove them from all your devices synced to iCloud. After the deletion, empty the recently deleted folder as it also takes up space on your storage. In the Files app under Locations, tap Recently Deleted. Tap Select from the menu, then click Delete All to permanently remove the files and free up space. You may also consider the other iCloud storage options. If you need more space, you can upgrade your iCloud storage plan for a monthly fee. On your phone settings, tap Apple ID. Locate iCloud. Click the Manage Storage, and then Change Storage Plan to see the available options. Okay, if I've been able to help you, I'd appreciate a thumbs up and a subscription. If something didn't work out and you're stuck, check the comments. Maybe someone has solved the problem. Otherwise, I can try and help you further. I offer personal support on Fiverr and can give you independent advice. I also offer many other services. Feel free to check them out.
you'll find the link in the video description. Until next time, bye.